Before we dive in, remember, these tools are powerful and should only be used ethically and legally. We're exploring the world of open source intelligence, OSINT, and what's possible with public data. I've spent over a hundred hours researching the most mind-blowing OSINT tools for tracking digital footprints. By the end, you'll see the internet in a whole new light. Let's get started. Number 10 on our list is Maltego, a digital corkboard for the modern investigator. Imagine the classic detective's board, covered in photos, notes, and red string. But now, it's all on your computer screen, powered by advanced algorithms and real-time data. Maltego doesn't just help you organize information, it actively connects the dots for you, automatically revealing relationships you might never have noticed on your own. With just a single piece of information, like a name, email address, or even a phone number, Maltego can map out a vast network of relationships across the internet. It scours public databases, social media, and other online sources to build a comprehensive picture. The software visualizes these connections in real time, showing how accounts, websites, emails, and even phone numbers are linked. This can reveal hidden associations, patterns, and sometimes even entire communities that would otherwise remain invisible. For example, you might start with a single social media profile. Maltego can then uncover other accounts connected to that profile, trace leaked information, and even extract metadata from photos, like where and when they were taken. It's like a chain reaction of discovery. Each new connection leads to more information, building a complex web that represents someone's entire digital life. The more you dig, the more you find. The free version of Maltego is already incredibly powerful, giving you access to a wide range of features. But if you need to go deeper, the paid versions unlock even more data sources and advanced analysis tools, making it a favorite among professional investigators. It's important to note that Maltego only uses publicly available information. There's no hacking or illegal access involved. Everything it finds is already out there, waiting to be discovered. Using Maltego can be a real eye-opener. It shows just how much personal data we unknowingly share online, and how easily it can be pieced together by anyone with the right tools. And this is just the beginning. Stay tuned as we dive deeper into the world of digital investigation tools. There's a lot more to uncover. Number nine is Google Dorking, an incredibly powerful technique that uses advanced search operators to uncover information most people don't even realize is available online. While most users stick to basic searches, Google Dorking lets you dig much deeper, revealing data that's often hidden in plain sight. With special commands like inurl, which searches for specific words in website URLs, in title, which finds pages with certain words in their titles, and file type, which locates specific types of files like PDFs, spreadsheets, or even confidential documents. You can uncover a surprising range of unsecured webcams, private documents, and even sensitive location data that was never meant to be public. These search operators act like digital keys, unlocking doors to information scattered across the web. By combining multiple dorks, you can get even more specific, finding entire photo galleries, extracting EXIF data from images to see when and where photos were taken, or even stumbling upon unprotected folders full of images and files that anyone can access, simply because they weren't properly secured. Ethical hackers and cybersecurity professionals use Google dorks as a first step in reconnaissance, gathering valuable information about targets before moving on to more advanced techniques. This process helps them map out digital footprints, piecing together clues about online activity, expose data, and potential vulnerabilities, all without ever breaking into a system. You can even search for usernames combined with location keywords to track movements, discover social media profiles, or find posts that reveal more than the user intended. Remember, all of this information is publicly accessible. There's no hacking or illegal access involved, just smart, strategic searching that takes advantage of what's already out there. Google is one of the most powerful free OSINT tools available, capable of revealing a wealth of data if you know the right queries and how to interpret the results. But with great power comes great responsibility. Always use these techniques ethically and respect privacy. Just because you can find something doesn't mean you should exploit it. The secrets are out there, hidden in plain sight, waiting for those who know how to look. Let's keep going and see what else we can uncover. Number eight is Social Searcher, a real-time search engine for social media. It monitors names, usernames, or keywords across dozens of platforms, filtering for geo-tagged content. Many people post with location tags without realizing it. Social Searcher finds those instantly, 
You can track someone's journey in near real time if they're posting with location data. It aggregates posts, users, and networks into a single dashboard. Even post content can reveal locations. Think tagged landmarks or event mentions. Social Searcher is a wake-up call. Every check-in or tagged photo is a breadcrumb. Be mindful of what you share. Number seven on our list is Creepy, a fascinating yet unsettling open source tool that specializes in aggregating geolocation information from social media platforms. Creepy's name isn't just for show, it truly highlights the sometimes eerie power of publicly available data. This software was created to demonstrate just how much personal information we unknowingly share online and how easily it can be pieced together by anyone with the right tools. All you have to do is enter a username, no passwords or hacking required. Instantly, Creepy scours public posts and photos across multiple social networks, searching for any geotagged content. Every time you or someone else posts a photo or status update with location data, Creepy collects it and plots it on an interactive map, creating a detailed visual trail of where that person has been. The result is a comprehensive visual history of someone's movements, complete with dates and timestamps. You can see patterns emerge, daily commutes, favorite hangouts, and even special trips. It's like watching a digital diary unfold, one pin at a time, revealing far more than most people realize they're sharing. With enough data, Creepy can even pinpoint frequent locations such as someone's home, workplace, or other places they visit regularly, all based solely on public posts. This level of detail can be both fascinating and alarming, especially when you consider how easily it's obtained. The creators of Creepy designed it not as a tool for stalking, but as a wake-up call, a way to raise awareness about the privacy risks we all face in the digital age. It's a reminder to think twice before sharing your location online and to regularly review your privacy settings. Even though the original Creepy tool is now considered somewhat dated, the concept behind it is more relevant than ever. Today's apps and social networks collect even more detailed location data, often without users fully realizing it. Once your location data is online, it can be collected, analyzed, and even sold. Data analysts and companies can use this information to build detailed profiles, track habits, or target ads, sometimes with unsettling accuracy. Creepy serves as a chilling reminder of just how easily our movements can be tracked in the modern world. Every geotagged post leaves a digital breadcrumb, and those breadcrumbs can quickly add up. Protect your privacy and be mindful of the digital trails you leave behind. Number six is Spokio, a people search engine that compiles public data from online and offline sources. It reveals current and past addresses, social profiles, and more, all from a name, phone, or email. Spokio connects the dots between profiles, building a detailed picture of someone's digital and physical life. It's a favorite for private investigators and background checks. An old address or linked profile can lead to more real-time location data. Spokio highlights how easily your information can be accessed and sold. Your data is a commodity. Be aware of what's out there. Privacy is more fragile than you think. Number five is IP Location Lookup, a foundational OSINT skill. Every device has an IP address, which can reveal a general location, often down to the city or neighborhood. You can get IPs from email headers, website logs, or link clicks. Use free lookup tools to find the country, city, and ISP. It's not pinpoint accurate, but it narrows the search area. IP data can also reveal VPN or proxy use. Combine IP info with other sources for a clearer picture. It's a simple but essential step in digital investigations. Number four is GeoSocial Footprint, a web tool that maps a user's social media activity. Enter a username and it scans for geotagged posts, check-ins, and location mentions. The results are plotted on an interactive map, showing movement patterns and hotspots. A heat map can reveal home, work, or daily routes. Aggregating hundreds of posts visually exposes routines and habits. It's a powerful lesson in data aggregation and privacy. For OSINT, it quickly gives spatial context to a target's digital life. One post is harmless, hundreds tell a story. Number three is Bin Verified, a deep dive people search service. It aggregates billions of data points from public records, revealing address history, phone numbers, and more. Bin Verified can uncover associates, vehicles, and even criminal records. It's a goldmine for establishing someone's physical footprint over time. Use it to verify identities or check backgrounds, but always stay within legal and ethical boundaries. Public records are powerful, but privacy is precious. Use this info wisely. Number two is OpenStreetMap, the Wikipedia of maps. 
It's free, open source, and often more detailed than commercial maps. Use it to verify geotagged locations, identify businesses, or map vulnerabilities. OSM's historical data lets you see how areas have changed over time. It's essential for adding context and detail to your investigation. The other tools find the coordinates. OSM tells you what's really there. Every serious OSINT investigator relies on it. Open source collaboration at its best. Number one is Sherlock, a command line tool that hunts for usernames across hundreds of sites. Many people reuse usernames and Sherlock automates the search, revealing where someone exists online. It's the ultimate way to expand your investigation's surface area. Find a username on niche forums or photo sites, and you might uncover location data or personal info. Each new profile is a potential goldmine for clues. Sherlock is fast, open source, and constantly updated. Sometimes the simplest tools are the most powerful. Map the digital world and you might just find the physical one. That's 10 of the most powerful OSINT tools for location tracking. The amount of public info available is staggering. Use it ethically and legally. Protect your own data and never invade someone's privacy. If you found this eye-opening, subscribe for more deep dives into the hidden corners of tech. Be smart, be safe, and see you in the next video.